Buying all your favorite groceries at a lower cost. Who could say no to that? RV Supermarket is officially taking over six Winn-Dixie stores in Jacksonville. Channel 4's Crystal Chan was at a ribbon cutting ceremony today where we got a better look at how you can save on thousands of grocery items. If you shop at Winn-Dixie, some of you may notice a big change as soon as you pull up into the parking lot. Six stores throughout Jacksonville, including the one here on Market Street, have now replaced their big red Winn-Dixie logo to a green sign that reads Harvey Supermarket. It's a switch that allows Southern grocers to attract a different demographic of shoppers. It's all about price. It's all about value. It's all about service. The change is designed to meet the needs of customers on a budget. The so first shock is the Harvey's name. Not really understanding maybe where the Harvey's name comes from, but once they come in the store and see the value and see the pricing and see all of the things we offer, it's been a really good acceptance. The makeover includes fresh yellow paint, new uniforms, and a cleaner look. On top of the physical changes, every Harvey store will have a dollar zone, which offers things like cleaning supplies. You've got candy here and also cereal. All of that you can buy for a dollar. You're going to see an entire new beauty section here with different beauty items, all priced relatively well. A great produce department with local offering. But the biggest change you'll notice is in the meat department, where the assortment will be tailored specifically to what the customer is looking for at a better price. It is exciting that they have, you know, uh, cake and they have music, so it does, it is very exciting to see something different. You'll also be able to save on gas and groceries by signing up and shopping with the Plenty Rewards card. And don't worry, the shift doesn't mean the end of Winn-Dixie stores. You'll still have 21 Winn-Dixie stores to shop in around Jacksonville. Crystal Chen, Channel 4, The Local Station.